Hi there. Before we dive into the tutorial, let's settle the age-old debate, which came first, the chicken, or the egg? While that question might never be answered, here on my channel, we know the answer, when you're a beginner, it's definitely the egg. It's just easier to make and a perfect starting point. So in this tutorial, I'll show you how to model a perfect 3D egg, step by step. This tutorial is designed for complete beginners. I'll guide you through 3D modeling an egg with a nice shape, clean topology, and a quick, efficient workflow. If you're completely new to Blender, here are the basic navigation controls. Hold the middle mouse button to rotate the view. Scroll the middle mouse wheel to zoom in and out. If you need to pan the view, hold Shift and the middle mouse button. Leave the default cube selected, then go to the Modifiers tab and add the Subdivision Surface Modifier. Set the Level Viewport to 3. After that, apply the modifier by clicking Apply. Then switch to Edit Mode. Go to Mesh, Transform, to Sphere. Press 1 on the keyboard, then hit Enter. This will round the edges, and the sphere will now consist of quads, just like it would if you started with a sphere object. Now switch back to Object Mode. Add a new object, a lattice. Press S to scale, then type 2 and hit Enter. This will double the size of the lattice and help it shape our egg. Click on the model, then go to the Modifiers tab, select Deform, and choose Lattice. In the Object field, select the Lattice object. Now select the Lattice and switch to Edit Mode. Using the mouse, select the top four vertices. Press S to scale, then drag the mouse to reduce the size by half. You can see the scale value in the top left corner. Alternatively, you can type 0.5 on the keyboard and press Enter to do the same. Now, with the top vertices still selected, press G to move. The object will move freely in 3D space. Then, if you press Z, the movement will be constrained to the Z axis, moving the object up and down. In 3D space, we have three axes, X, Y, and Z, and pressing Z will move the object up and down along the Z axis. While moving, hold Ctrl to snap the movement to increments, and also hold Shift to make finer adjustments. Move the vertices by 0.1m, you'll see the value in the top left corner. You can do this roughly as well. Just press G, then Z, move, and confirm with a left click. If you press the right mouse button, the action will be cancelled, which is useful if you want to try again or adjust it differently. Now, switch back to Object Mode, click on the egg, go to the Modifiers tab, select Lattice, and click Apply. Right-click on the egg and select Shade Smooth to smooth the polygon appearance. Then go to the Modifiers tab, choose Generate, and select Subdivision Surface. Set the value to 2 for an even smoother look. Left click on the lattice again, then right click and select delete. The lattice has shaped the object, and we no longer need it. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you'd like to see the next part, where we'll set up basic shaders and materials for our egg, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Let me know in the comments if you want more beginner friendly tutorials like this one. Until next time, happy blending.